are free from Persephone's grip. Grass, Babinos. Elysium awaits you. You surprise me. When we first met, I was positive you were sent by Persephone to... To what? Seduce me. Confuse me. Anything to make me forget my love. But when I asked you to weaken Persephone's influence, you did. I asked you to bring me warriors, and here they are. And all I had to do was risk my life for you to trust me. No one in Elysium is who they say. So when a clever warrior shows up to help me escape, you'll have to excuse me if I'm skeptical. <clears throat> Time to find more warriors. Scout spotted one nearby, was a Spartan hero in his former life. He's not under Persephone's influence, but keeps mostly to himself. With a champion like him on our side, we can't fail. How will I know when I find him? From what I'm told, you can't miss him. You've had your alone time. Tell me what's next. You're keeping up. Good. There's one more place we must weaken Persephone before our time together draws to a close. Her most devoted followers are gathering in a villa near Persephone's embrace. These are the most vile humans in Elysium that serve her every whim and dark desire. Are they under her possession? You might say they're more obsessed than possessed. But if you're thinking you can save these humans, you're sorely mistaken. Persephone's hold on them is too strong. Whatever gets us closer to bringing down Persephone. I'm glad you see reason. So what do you have in mind for Persephone's followers? Poison in their wine should do the trick. Unfortunately, the wolf nearby ate the last of my aconite. You'll need to hunt it and extract the poison from its liver. This symposium shouldn't be too difficult to infiltrate. But once you're there, try to blend in with the other Persephone-obsessed humans. I'll find the poison and infiltrate the symposium. Don't worry. There'll be plenty of time to leave once the humans start drinking. Good luck.
Jesus. Τριών A fresh face. Is this your first time at a devoted follower symposium? Ah, uh, yes. Don't look so nervous, friend. Why don't you go meet some people and then we will toast to our new arrivals? Oh. If you're at a loss for words, let other members know whether you think Adonis or Hermes is Persephone's soulmate. We debate that for hours here. Tell me, stranger. Who do you think Persephone's soulmate is? The god or the human? Hermes. He clearly adores Persephone. Thank the gods! Someone here with some sense. Hermes doesn't get his due. He would follow Persephone to the end of the underworld. <laughs> <laughs> Persephone sent Adonis the most beautiful boat after he destroyed another Thalita trying to escape his <laughs> Settle an argument, friend. We just got word that Persephone is expanding her palace. Should she build into the east or west of Elysium? Only the best for Persephone. So, east. What? No! There's nothing for her to see in the east. What's she going to stare at? A Katis hovel? <laughs> that makes no sense. <laughs> Did you hear that Persephone refused to his I know they're old rumors, but what do you think of the whispers that Hecate seeks to steal Persephone's throne for herself? They look like good friends to me. 
You know, I completely agree. Persephone needs someone like Ekate by her side supporting her. I'm ready for the toast. You know, everyone is saying what a great conversationalist you are. So knowledgeable about Persephone. You'll be a perfect fit here. These people really don't seem as corrupt as Hecate made them out to be. <laughs> Everyone gather to toast our new members. To Persephone. To Persephone. He said it would take time to sink in. I'd better get out of here before. Gatti owes me answers. This symposium wasn't at all what I expected. Why do I get the feeling I've been played? Off we go now. Leonidas? You 
you have the eyes of my daughter. So something did survive that day. How do you have this? Mirini. She's my mother. I'm here because I need your help. I need you to fight. I have found peace here. Why would I fight? All my life, I was told of my grandfather. The king who spat in the face of the gods and ran his spear through anyone who threatened the freedom of his people. Now I'm the one fighting for freedom, and I'm asking my grandfather for help. We'll need to use the terrain to our advantage. So you'll fight with us? Not until you fight me. You say you're Marini's son. I want to see how she trained you. I could have used you at Thermopylae. You could have used a lot of people at Thermopylae. I am glad this spear is in your hands. I will fight with you. You have my word as a Spartan. Thank you, Grandfather. He is. How is Leonidas fitting in? Morale's never been higher. Scouts are reporting Persephone's influence is weakening across Elysium. You're definitely causing havoc out there. I won't rest until it's done. You know, I'm starting to think Elysium isn't such a bad place with you in it. Yes. If only you weren't in love with Aphrodite, and trying to overthrow the Queen, and everyone else wasn't dead. Elysium would be perfect. 
All I'm saying is you breathe life into this world filled with dead people. Anyhow, we have a bit of a situation. Of course we do. Persephone's guns have cut off supply lines, overtaken hideouts, secrets in locations she couldn't possibly have known without inside help. We suspect there is a spy in our midst. Who? One is a messenger. She was sent with crucial information to one of our camps. When she didn't return, we sent a scout. The entire camp was killed, and she was nowhere to be found. The other is a blacksmith. Soldiers love to gossip while getting their blade sharpened. We think he may have overheard some of our plans. That's a good start. They both have homes in the village. Return to me once you're done. Messenger's house. A broken piece from one of the torches of Hypnos I destroyed. So Persephone knows we've recruited Leonidas. Detailed information about one of Adonis's rebel camps. Definitely the house of a blacksmith. Note written to Aphrodite. The blacksmith told her everything. Adonis's escape plans, the rebellion. Ah, a list of people Adonis has spent time with. Mine and Persephone's names are on this. And who's the dirty spy? The messenger or the blacksmith? Both have been spying on you. Both have information that could undo your rebellion. Lousy malakas. My scouts tell me they're on the move. We only have time to dispose of one before they disappear completely. Which is more dangerous to our cause? The blacksmith had a list of people you've spent time with, and a note to Aphrodite outlining your plans for escape. And what about the messenger? She had detailed information about one of your rebel camps, a note to Persephone about Leonidas joining the fight, and a fragment of one of the mind control devices I destroyed. The messenger needs to be stopped. Last I heard, she was spotted at a small rebel camp. I don't want to be spotted here.
The messenger is dead. The camp was ambushed. I did what I could. Any news on the blacksmith? He escaped. If he reports back to Persephone, many lives are in danger. Our next move needs to be swift and deadly. Meet me later at the palace of the Colossi. I've acquired a little something that will turn Persephone's paradise upside down. Keeper, there you are. The queen is in Death Galeon's heritage and requires your presence. She says it's quite urgent. 